What's up, champs? I just got back last night uh, to Vancouver after four, after six weeks traveling. It's nice to be back, look at around. Although it's a little bit chilly, we are in winter season, but uh, Vancouver is a beautiful city. And I was coming for six weeks. I went to Uganda, then I went to Egypt, back to Europe. I went to Italy, Spain, uh, back to Czech Republic, went for five days to Dubai, Germany, and so I traveled a lot. But it's nice to be back, so hopefully in summer we can... Uh... Actually, I'm planning to do some training in summer here. What's up, champs? Look at who I have next to me. Hi, everybody <laughs> out there! Listen, funny... Oops. Funny story. This guy is actually contacting me on Instagram and next day we met and I found out that this guy is from Kampala, Uganda, actually where I have a soccer school. The 256, the 256 is so incredible. So um, Small word, eh? I saw a documentary of Libor on uh, his Instagram of uh, the project that they had done in Kampala. And um, one of the neighborhoods actually even looked familiar, Makindi. To the yeah. Makindi, so I was like, oh my God. Yeah, there's the school. Such a small world out here. <laughs> no, that's so funny. That's so funny. Small world. Like, yeah. So now we are back in Vancouver, back at work, back and back in rain. Raincouver, as rain you call it. Raincouver. So I was the trip was cool because I was there for six weeks. It was funny. I was long, not long actually, but I was good. I was good, interesting because we flew from Vancouver to Brussels. We brought thousand shoes and wow. uh, my friend drove from Prague or eight hours. How many bags of shoes were those? A thousand 20. shoes? <laughs> 20 bags, 20 big bags. Oh my God. That was cool, that A was thousand, cool. No. I think we brought in past four years in Uganda around, I think 4,000 shoes, which is incredible. Like it's fun. But anyway, we went to Brussels, we stayed overnight, then we flew to, to Uganda, spent a week in Uganda, then we went to Egypt for first time in Cairo, and I was very excited, actually, oh, it was a nice city. That was so nice. Well... You saw the pyramids? You saw... Oh man, I was juggling at the pyramids, but, <laughs> but you know what? I want to open school in Cairo, so actually, Whoa. tiny things, I, I met my friend Farida, she got the soccer academy for girls, and nice. I... I found even coach, so I think we're gonna do camp together late in uh, June. So I will be flying in. I will be flying to to Cairo. We're gonna have a camp together, and in September I wanna open the school. So I'll, I will go for it because this city actually is incredible. I like it. I like. I want to go back there. Whoa, Cairo! Here we come. We open Cairo this year. <laughs> if not, we open school in Pakistan. Wow. <laughs> no. So yeah. So then from Cairo. From Cairo, I went back to Europe, spent one week with my family. I have two beautiful nieces, so it was fun. And uh, then I went to Milan, Italy. I went to Barcelona for a couple of days, back to back to Europe, spent a couple of days in Prague, went to Dubai, spent five incredible days in Dubai. It was my first time, it was hot, but great, I love it. And also I wanna do camp, so I think this year in December, we're gonna do World Soccer World, do a camp in Dubai. Whoa. And uh, funny enough, Funny enough, uh, what I was going to say, I don't even know, I forgot. <laughs> you have to go in. Yo, isn't your passport full right now? You have been I have two passports. I have two passports. Two passports I love traveling. But anyway, uh, so I will be going back to Europe and Africa in June, July. I will be traveling for June, July. So I'm supposed to call actually in five minutes to one guy from, from Cape Town. So Cape Town, he also South con Africa. Also contacted me on Instagram. So we start talking and so orga he's organizing camp for, for me there. So I will go for first time in Cape Town. So I think I'm going to go Cape Town, Uganda. I will go to Cairo. And what is funny and good, it's not actually funny. It's very interesting. We're taking kids, <laughs> four kids plus coach from Uganda. We're taking them to whoa, Czech Republic whoa, for the camp. Whoa. And after... Congratulations. We to them. take them to Sweden to Gotia Cup. So those kids, they didn't have a passport, so we had to make them a passport. Need never the documents. They never flew in uh, in, oh in plane. Wow. So for the first time yeah. they will be flying in a plane, and I will record amazing. everything, and I will show you later. Also, I, I just recorded. I I spoke with them three days ago. I called the coach. I recorded the. Uh, I recorded the, the the phone call from Vancouver to Uganda. 
and uh, they were so happy. So I will also post it very soon. I can't imagine how happy those guys could have been. Hey, let's. I have to call the guys from Cap Town. So wow. let me call him. You know, let's try to call him. Having such an opportunity to play soccer on an international platform. Oh my gosh, those guys are gonna play their hearts out. They're gonna. <laughs> they're wow. going to play their hearts and out. You know what? Also, two players out of four play for national Uganda national team. They're very talented. Oh, wow, wow. So. Hey buddy, how are you? Good and you? Very good, very good. You know, funny enough, I'm driving with my friend again. <laughs> we have another meeting, so I'm calling you again. Just, just so, how is Cape Town? Yes. Hey. How is Cape Town? How how are you guys doing there? No, Cape Town is good. Yeah. No, Cape Town is good. I, it's, I not, it's, it's not too hot, which it's is the perfect time to come. Wow, nice. Because <laughs> it does get a bit hot. Oh yeah, I saw the I saw the yes. clips. I love it, man. I'm very excited. So, let me work. Uh -huh. I'm just uh, I'm just working on those dates for because I have to go also to Uganda and, and Egypt in Cairo. So yes, I will, yes, yes. I will I will I think in a few days I will let you know the dates uh -huh. and then we can just finalize everything. Sounds good. Perfect. No, no, that's perfect. That's perfect. And I was also looking at the hotels yesterday, so also like in a couple of days I will give all the dates and my hotel and then we can start organizing. It's going to, I'm very excited. I think it's going awesome. to be a great time. Let's see. As I told you, like I yes. spoke with... So the choice is yours. The choice is yours. I think, I think for me, because uh, obviously, obviously after, the, after the whole training and everything, you want to go relax, see the city and all of that. Uh, so it's really up to you. Like to drive around in Cape Town doesn't take that long. Sounds good. Yeah, well, yeah. As I said, I spoke mm. with a couple of people here, and they they told me that the Cape Town is beautiful. So, mm. so mm. yeah, I'm excited. You know what? Like, if cool. it would be for me, I'm just gonna spend all the time on the field because, as I told you, I'm crazy. <laughs> I'm, you just put me on the soccer foot twenty four. Then I need to organize more teams for you. Then I need to organize more teams. For you. <laughs> I think for the beginning, for the beginning, my first visit, it's enough. Like three teams. But I'm told you, like I'm gonna, right. I'm, the, the the field is be burning. It's gonna be on fire. Oh. Burn, <laughs> please, man. <laughs> you will see. I'm telling you, like you're gonna run behind me and say, "Libor, can you stop?" <laughs> oh, my once I, I told oh, my you, goodness. once I step on the okay. field, it's my bubble, so I'm crazy. But outside of the field, I'm very relaxed. So you will see. We're gonna have so much All fun. Right. All right. No, perfect, perfect, man. All right, so give me a couple of days <laughs> and I will get back to you, all right? All right, perfect, man. Thank you, enjoy your evening. Cheers. Okay, Same bye. to you, enjoy bye your day bye. further. <laughs> Ciao.